90% of the ash trees here in Ireland are affected by ash dieback. Ash dieback is not only a problem for these trees, but a biological, social and economical problem. But what if we could change that? My name is Abby O'Brien Murray. I'm currently doing theoretical physics at Trinity College Dublin. Our team, LINRA, made up of five members, have spent the past six weeks building our microinjection rover for a current treatment for ash dieback. Our names are Abby, Olivia and Erica. Our project's titled, Can We Save the Common Ash? We developed the treatment um, originally for the BT Young Scientist. Um, we spent roughly two years working on it. Uh, the treatment has a short-term Irish patent and as of today, you'll be able to find the UK patent published. But what we didn't realise at the time was well, application method is a big issue when trying to target this at scale. The rover is that solution to applying this to trees at scale. My name is Amelia. I'm currently studying immersive software engineering in UL. What we're seeing here is our current prototype. The rover is currently using AI to detect saplings in the area, drive up to the sapling itself, um, detect the base. Um, it is using a stepper motor to swivel the plate um, and then a piston to inject the tree. I'm Sinead Ahern and I worked mostly on the electronics and the robotics for this project. The team is mostly women, we're four women and um, one guy, Sean. Um, it just formed that way because we had the skills necessary for this project. Both Abby and Erica had done the initial research for three years and then me and Amelia just had the necessary skills. I was good at robotics and electronics and Amelia is an absolute wizard with developing AI and all that kind of software stuff. It's honestly just so exciting to see how far we've come, not only in just these six weeks, but how far we plan to get within the next few years. Um, the team have spent a very long six weeks uh, building Rover, working through ideas, what would be the best method, how would this affect the tree. Uh, the other two that weren't working on Rover were planning our trial study to see how we could actively use this in the field. Um, and it's gonna be so exciting just to see that in action. It would mean the world for us to see something that we started at the age of 17, be able to go further and be able to save these trees across the world.